gratitude, gratitude, gratitude. You hear it all the time. It's like a trending topic and you're like, I think gratitude is bullshit. Um, you, I, we have a lot in common. So I was like forced into gratitude. I um, went through like life stuff and then I got a coach and um, with like, it was for fitness, but the guy was like, hey, we have to do gratitude. And I was like, okay, this is like crap. And I was totally an eye roller. And um, so every call we would have to say we were grateful for. We did a group call once a week. We had to say we were grateful for. And I always will totally remember the story. This guy was in our group and he, the thing that he said he was grateful for was like he went to this park and he sat under this tree and the sky was so blue and I was just like rolling my eyes and I'm like how is this guy like wasting our time with this and like I was pretty much like friends and family like my house or whatever right like the big things um and then like as we went on I started kind of like developing the skill a bit and understanding kind of the value and gratitude um, but it probably took me like 10 months to go from the big eye roll to the freaking total believer and that's where I am now. So guys, even if you think it's bullshit or if you're doing gratitude a little bit, but not really like on a daily basis, sometimes when you remember, um, every day when you wake up, let the first thing in your mind be gratitude. Like, what are you grateful for? Did you wake up? Then that's something to be grateful for. Did you wake up in a bed? Did you wake up on a floor? A couple of things to be grateful for. If you were lucky enough to wake up in a bed, did you have like a blanket or a pillow? Like, and then what about like your body? You know, like anything on your body that you have some people don't have like think about it in like that kind of aspect what if you didn't have something then you would freaking miss it right so think about it in that kind of way as well like if you didn't have hands or if you didn't have feet or legs like think about how your day would be if you didn't have those things so why not be grateful for them every day um it also gratitude is kind of like the gateway drug to like awareness like awareness of what's around you the people around you your environment your thoughts um and then that kind of goes into mindset and that's a whole <laughs> another thing but gratitude let's challenge yourself let's do it for one week guys one week wake up think about three things you're grateful for write them down on a piece of paper and then at the end of the day when you're back in bed read those three things again and then in the next morning wake up write three new things okay and then repeat that for a week tell me how it is if you're a non-believer try it and if you're like kelly this is bullshit that's all right write it in the comments if you did it for seven days and you did it for seven days um or if you're kind of like i'm trying to do the practice but i'm not doing it every day now's the time to challenge yourself let me know I'm super excited to hear from you. Let me know in the comments when you're gonna start. Um, guys, if you're doing it and it's your first time trying to practice gratitude and you miss a day, it's okay. Like just do it the next day. Or instead of doing it the next day, if you were like, oh, I didn't do my gratitude in the morning, do it wherever you are, <laughs> whenever you are, it's free. You can literally do it anywhere in the world. Do you go to the bathroom the day? Maybe that's how you wanna do it. You go to the bathroom, you list three things you're grateful for. Like that's a good habit. You know, something that you're doing every day, you're brushing your teeth, list three things you're grateful for just add it in your daily habits all right let me know how it's going guys link below for your gratitude sheet